love to sit. I'm a lean, mean, speed thingy. Hello everybody, Slim Kirby here. Welcome back to more Let's Play The Simpsons Hit and Run. Uh, in this video, I'm going to give it a few extras, and then I'll probably do Mission 3, and then also the second street race. So, uh, let's get started. Uh, the first level card we're going to get is actually a card we've been passed numerous times. Uh, it's right there, in the dirty water. Uh, this is actually the trickiest level card to get. Just because you got to be really good at platforming, and... The platforming controls for this game are, they're okay, but eh, they're not the best. That was close. And if you fall in, you have to start over, so you want to make sure you get this on the first try. I can tell this and that is the hell to pay from, uh, trying to think, I knew it was season 10, I think? It was either season 10 or 9, which would make it either the 8th Treehouse of Horror or the 9th. I'm going to go with uh, the 8th, so let's check. Alright, wrong. No, I keep going to the wrong thing. Oh. Of course, they give us the actual sub-chapter name and not the actual tree as a whore. I'm pretty sure it's 8. If it's not, it's a 9. It's either one of those, but it's either in the ninth season or the 10th season. I know that much. Okay, I need to get my car back, which is Where on the other side of the graveyard, on? so better use a phone booth. Sorry if I'm going a little bit slow for the start of this. Rubs. And as you can see, I am Dirty Homer because it lost the pole. It Get lost by a big margin. Uh, you really want to know how much it lost by? Well, let's just say that uh, when I did the vote countings, uh, the votes for Evil Homer and for Donut Homer actually crashed my Microsoft Word document when I was doing the find all matches of it. So it actually crashed my document, which is actually kind of weird. So yeah, uh, you guys really did actually cause quite a bit of stir in the actual voting process. It wasn't really a landslide this time. It was between two choices, but definitely not for just one. Uh, so yeah, I'll announce uh, the next costume in the next video, and then after that, I'll be using uh, the winner throughout the rest of the level, and that's how that will work. So yeah, we have the typical wasp hammer that's up there. I'm hoping I'm not missing any wasp cameras. This is actually the hardest level to find them all in because they're just scattered all over the place. That wasn't part of the deal. Uh, let's see. And yeah, there's another one down there. I know there's one at the power plants. I know there's one I missed at the school. Yeah, I really don't know how many I have left, just because there's so many areas they're in. I'll probably have to use a guide just to find out where the last one is, because I don't really want to search all over the place. Okay, let's check out what we're doing. Okay, we have four more. I know there's going to be one coming up, another one there, one in the school. Yeah, there's definitely going to be one, at least one unaccounted for. But I'm sure I'll figure it out eventually. And yes, let's drive a random car. Yay, we're in a wooden casket, actually. Wow, that's kind of weird. Okay, over here in this barnyard, I think we have a lost camera, and we also have that collector card as well. Actually, I'm not seeing the wasp camera, though. Maybe it's on top of the roof. Nope. Okay, I'm... Actually, I have two wasp cameras unaccounted for now. Just great. Because I know there's one at the power plant. Okay, okay. Okay, there's just one. Because I remember there's a one that's actually inside the power plant. And then there's one at the school, so I'm actually down one, so I'll have to look very hard for that last one. Ah, come on. Okay, I made it this time. Now be very careful when getting the... I missed it! Okay, but there's that wasp camera, which means 
all of them are actually accounted for now, so I don't have to worry about that anymore. That's weird. I didn't jump. I didn't do the double jump right there, which is weird. Oh god, that's going to make that really annoying. Oh, I jumped over it. Oh, come on. Okay, maybe this is the toughest one to get. Okay, there we go. Lost camera down. Okay, let's actually get this level collector card now. Uh, crap. I've already wasted five minutes. Maybe I won't have that street race done. Okay. Uh, okay, I got it. And that is the monkey's paw from Treehouse of Horror 2. So, closest... I'll uh, just use the wooden crate. Okay, so we're almost done. Uh... Probably won't be able to get the street races done in this video as I planned, but that's not a very big concern of mine, to be honest. Okay, uh, over here we have the third mission before I get it though. Lost camera over here. I believe in my original project I actually missed this one for the longest time before I finally realized it was right there the whole time. Okay, I'm also going to make sure I'm going to want to get my... wait no, never mind. Uh, as for the wasp camera that's inside the power plant, it's actually up here on this ladder, but I'll be going inside the power plant later anyway, so I'll get that then. Anyways, third mission. I'm glad you're here, my morbidly obese ally. Based on my manipulations, I figured out the alien's weakness. It's nuclear waste. Yuck. Uh, and how does that affect me? Well, it could save the life of you and your family. And? <laughs> Look, I've loaded my vehicle with nuclear waste from the power plant. It's going to deliver this toxic payload to the alien ship, risking myself and my delicious brain to zombie snacking. Which, if you've never undergone that, I can tell you it stings. What a hero. And I never knew his name. Ah, uh, it's Professor John Frank. Are you still here? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, pocket protector. Protect Professor Frank from the aliens. Deliver the nuclear waste to the spaceship. Okay, pay attention to what you're doing in this mission, because we'll have to do this kind of mission three more times after this. Uh, the last three missions are basically doing this over and over again. So what you have to do is you have to deliver this toxic waste to the school. What's hard about it is uh, you can't hit very many things, or you can't hit something really hard. Otherwise, the waste will drop from your car and you'll have to restart the mission. Actually, you won't have to restart the mission, but you'll have to drive back to the power plant and get a new bucket of waste, which can be very, very annoying. But failing a mission, uh, you got to, like, run out of time. That's the only way to fail a mission. Shoot, okay, that's close. Oh, I thought that was my car that was smoking, but it was the random car. Looks harder than it is. Okay, I'm doing pretty well right now, but... Okay, I still gotta make it to the school in 40 seconds. Take this jump very softly, otherwise you'll go flying into a wall back there. That's one problem I'll have in probably one of the later variations of this. But I'm almost at the school now, so I should be able to complete this within the time limit. Okay, 20 seconds. Oh, crap. Oh, gosh, hit and run. I almost forgot about that. Yes, also avoid hit and run as much as possible. And... Okay, we're at the school. Now you have to drive the car straight into the spotlight thing. And sure enough, wasp camera. It's okay, that's the wasp camera. We only have one more left, and then we'll be done with wasp cameras. Thank God. Okay, so Homer was uh, going on about needing more toxic waste to take out the spaceship. And that's what the last three missions will consist of. Uh, mission 4 is pretty much a mini-mission of uh, Homer doing something. Uh, just very small. It's basically setting up the last two missions. Now, I still have a minute worth of time, but there's not much I can really do. Um, I don't know. I guess I'll talk about a few other things. Uh, 
First of all, I just want to give a quick shout out to K Man Rules 1331. Uh, he posted a trailer for his next Let's Play, which is actually going to be Pikmin, a game I've done. But I highly encourage you to check out his Let's Play. It's uh, coming up on October 12th. I'll give you a link to his uh, Let's Play in my video description. And definitely check it out because he is a good Pikmin player and he is a good Let's Player. So definitely look out for that. Um, again, just to remind you for tomorrow's video, I'll have the second place winner of the poll. And then I'll also um, do some street races maybe. And then th this mission. And that'll be tomorrow's video. Uh, as for the game being completed... I'd say the game would be completed either Saturday, Sunday, or Monday. I'm leaning more till uh, Sunday right now, though. But we'll see what happens. Uh, there's many things that can happen, so we'll just wait until then. This is Slim Kirby. See you guys next time for more Let's Play The Simpsons Hit and Run. Later, folks.